Okay, welcome to the next episode of Random Euro Truck Simulator. So we're now making a very short journey um, over to this refinery or whatever it is um, just across the road to pick up our next delivery, which will either be um, Bill, I think it was Bill Bow in Spain, in the Basque region, or um, Sicily in Italy via Barcelona, via ferry from Barcelona. So we're going to do a random, we're going to do a random number generator in just a second to decide not just which of the two places we're going to be going to. Uh, Thing's not plugged in, it's making it a bit jumpy. Just a sec. There we go. Um, yeah, to find out where we're going to, and also to find out where we're going to be allocating the, the point to as well. Let's just double check the two op the, op well, the options available. So, yeah, it's Bill Bow. Which is a short journey. It's a very short journey, um, actually, over the border into Spain. Or it's how do I say this place? Olbia. Um, yeah, over in Sicily, via Spain, via Barcelona. So let's find out where we're going to. Right. So first up, it's the point allocation. Um, hang on. Let me just randomize this first of all as I always do and then we're talking about one to six let's see what we get four we've had four before oh, that rhymes we've had four before um, well and now we've got it again I can't remember what it is but it's not the increased distance one so that's that done now we need to do the one for the journey between one and two. So one is Bill Bow and two is, is it Ob oh, I can't remember the name of it, but it was somewhere in Sicily. We are going to Sicily. Okay, interesting one. Right, let's allocate the skill points to the fourth one down. Oh, it's its third one. Wow, this one is uh, very popular. Fragile cargo. Um, so, could be earning a fair bit of money from fragile cargo. Um, yeah, the only one we haven't done yet or haven't included is just in time delivery, which I'm quite happy about. That's my least favorite because it pushes me for time, which I don't particularly like. So, it's working out quite well. Um, but okay, let's um, accept the route. This is there. Okie dokie. Right, we're taking motor oil um, to Sicily. Um, let's have a look at the map. So we're not, oh sorry, we are going to be taking that little road from Lac over the border into Spain, which I'm looking forward to. I'm looking forward to this journey within Spain. 
We've got a fair distance to travel, which is pretty cool. Hang on, why is why don't we go this way? That would save a bit of time, wouldn't it? One, two, three, two. Oh no, that doesn't work. It must be like uh, I don't think you can go that way. Um, hmm, that's weird. I think the road just goes round. Okay. Zoom out again. Yeah, I mean it's a direct route to Barcelona, that's for sure. Um, and then yeah, from Barcelona over to Sicily. A little right, a little drive in Sicily over to Olbia. Um, is good for me. So let's leave it there. And let's continue with the journey. Okay, so I'm quite looking forward to this journey as we get to experience a little bit of the Iberia map. Okay, here we go. And then we get to head off to um, Sardinia, which I think is one of my map add ons. I don't think this is um, the Italian map, the Italian DLC map. I'm looking forward to crossing over into Spain on this little small road as well. Turn right. So a few things to talk about here. Um, yeah, firstly about destination. Um, I've never been to Sicily, so I've got nothing to talk about with regards to that. Um, Turn right. So I did contemplate whether I should actually include this route because if you've watched my previous episodes you'll know that I don't like ferries in this game I understand the necessity of them um, Get ready to turn. but I think there's too many ferries on the game unrealistic however Sicily is an island <laughs> so the only way of getting to Sicily is by ferry now ideally I'd like to do that from it mainland Italy because that's the closest um, place on land to Sicily but I had a look on <clears throat> I think freight link it's called or something and it and it is uh, there is such a thing as a ferry from Barcelona to uh, into um, Sardinia. It's not some kind of made up um, ferry route, which is why I allowed myself to to do this particular route. However, I've also given myself a little rule here that I'm not going to then go on to the Italian mainland from Sardinia. Uh, I will allow myself to take a route that takes me to Corsica, which again would involve taking a ferry. Um, preferably, I want to be going back to Barcelona and continuing my journey from there. Basically, by going to Sardinia, it's a little detour as long as I eventually end up back in Barcelona after <laughs> after my trip to Sardinia and possibly Corsica. I don't know, I just don't like this idea of having these ferries transporting you from one place to another. This is really interesting because we're going to... Oh, there's the place. There we go. That's interesting, isn't it? That's where we were. I like that. That's nice. I should quite like to stop and have a look at that. But I won't. Ooh, it was crashed there. I've got to be careful on these bends. It's a 
So we're about to enter a new country, Spain. It's been a long time since we entered a new country. The last one was Switzerland. That was a while back. Um, so let me work out how many <laughs> countries that is now. England, France, Belgium, Germany, Austria, Switzerland. I think it's country number seven. And it's also going to be, we're also going to have experience country number eight, which is Italy, um, in this journey as well. Not the Italian mainland, but Italy nonetheless. It's nice. Oh, we've got um, one of those video things coming up. This is one of these routes you want to be doing in the daytime, which we are doing, of course. Because if this was if this was the dark, you just wouldn't see anything at all. You just wouldn't, wouldn't be able to appreciate it. So the viewpoint is supposed to be at the border, like this. It's nice. Right, I'm going to pull in to have a look at this view. I don't know what it's going to show us. Is it just going to be a view of the border or the whole area? Let's have a look. Let's go for a tunnel as well, it looks like. This is a really interesting border. Oh no, it's just a view of the Le Fourgue de Abel. So obviously the French side. Can't say I've heard of this place. It looks nice. Because yeah, I mean, generally the border between France and Spain is very picturesque, mountainous. Hello, hello cows. Huh. Would be a good place for hiking. This is one of the nicer viewpoints. I don't, when, he, when we did the, the one, um, the port of, of Calais, like, what's the point? Why is it showing us the port of Calais? Oh, that's where we are. Yeah, we're about to head under that, through that tunnel. Quite mysterious, you know, that, that's the border with Spain and like, you just go through a tunnel and who knows what's on the other side. <laughs> Something Spanish, or possibly Basque. France. I like it. I really enjoyed that. That was good. It's the best one so far of those videos that I've done. Oh, there's something coming, I'll let him pass. Right. Presumably, we're about to enter Spain. Yeah, really looking forward to checking to checking out Spain. Um, should be well developed. Lots of interesting things to see on routes. I'm not familiar with Spain on this game. I've barely touched it before. I think I've been to Barcelona once, but like directly from France, not actually driving through Spain like we're doing now. And even then, I don't even know if that. Would be. That was with the add-on, it might have been before the add-on. Uh, where are we going? Straight on. Sec. Okay. We're going the right way. It's 
See, this is what it's about in this game. Get off those bloody motorways and you want to be on roads like this, I'm telling you. The motorways are all right if you just want to kind of meditate. <laughs> Look at that, little tower there, I like that. Can't see it like that. Driven up there. Hmm. Oh, do I need, I need petrol. I almost forgot. Oh my god. That was so lucky. Thank Suddenly you. remembered. Let's get some petrol in Spain. The last time I filled up was in Switzerland. Right. I wonder if it's cheaper in Spain than it in Switzerland. It probably must be. I mean, <laughs> Switzerland's crazy. It's prices. I don't know, I can't remember how much I paid in Switzerland. Probably not much in it, but I can't remember. Maybe there's a way I can check. If you check for your history of like expenses, can you do that in the game? downhill. Hopefully the, the whole journey doesn't go downhill from here. <laughs> if you get the pun. Oh, not to crash. Some like yellow stuff. It's 90 along here, so the same speed limit as France, the motorways, which is good. So I don't know how long I've got left on the journey because it's showing with the ferry journey as well, which is always misleading. I think the overall distance was 600 odd kilometers. Bit of a way, but not too bad. And most of the driving is in Spain. So we did a, a little bit in France just to get to the border. And we've got, a, well, Sardinia is really small anyway, so we won't be doing much driving there. Okay, now it's uphill. <laughs> Frisco. Jeez, this is a struggle. I like this. I'm going to overtake. Wow. Oh. Maybe took him easily there. Ah, oh, this was that part where I was getting confused. Oh. Well, I looked on the map. Yeah, this is what I thought would happen. They sent us all the way around. Oh, what's that? Interesting, that road was closed. This is nice, this is really nice.
wow, this really is uphill. I haven't experienced anything like this before. Really nice round here. What's all that? So yeah, I'm assuming this is all from the Iberia DLC. Bloody hell, did you see the way he just cut in front of me, the bastard? That was a miracle we didn't crash there. That would have been his fault. Now it's all downhill again. Really interesting uh, road. This I like the the red lights on the arrow sign as well. That's, that's pretty neat. In terms of a rest stop, surely I'll get my rest on the ferry. It's a long ferry ride over to Sardinia. Keep Saw Barcelona on the signpost for the first time. That is where we're heading to to catch the ferry as well. Keep right and then exit right. Exit right. Uh, is it here? Yeah. Put the second one, I think. Barcelona. Barcelona. Yeah, like I said, I don't really know how far we are away from um, Barcelona. We'll just keep driving. Only 60 along here on this slip road. Oh, 
Oh, we've got one of those toll booths coming up. Well, let's hope I can navigate this correctly, not like in Switzerland, or Austria, sorry, where I completely had a right nightmare. Although, mind you, that nightmare in Austria was nothing compared to what, what I then experienced in France. Um, it wants me to stay on the right-hand side. Okay, there we go, that's straightforward. Let's try and have a look to see how far we are away from Barcelona. Just zoom out on the map. Don't know at the moment. But we're heading east in the right direction. I mean, so again, like in other parts of Western Europe, it's not particularly interesting driving along the motorway, even in somewhere like Spain. I mean, the scenery is quite different to say, some, to, say, to say Germany, for example, or even France. Like, it definitely looks, mm, let's say, like a hotter region, I guess, of Europe. looks a bit, not desert-like, but I don't know, just a type of terrain. It's quite different. Like that road on the right hand side, which you can't drive on. Just, but just the fact they've got it there, it's pretty cool. Right, we're in Catalonia. Can't be too far from Barcelona.
I'll just tell you, yeah, just don't know what to say. Just driving along. Having the time of my life. Okay, I think the port is just about on the map now. So I'm getting different information regarding this ferry right over to Sardinia. Somewhere it's written it's, it only runs once a week. I think it's to do with the seasons though. Like in certain seasons it's more frequent than others. Well, in the summer, basically, it's where it's, it's most frequent. And it's uh, operated by Grimaldi, I think it's called Grimaldi Lights. Jeez, it's a, it's a massive queue for this. Why are they all in this lane? How many other ones work? Oh, yeah, they do. Must be a type of payment. Jeez, it's not like this in France. This is slow. Can I cheat? Can I get around outside? <laughs> Just crash through. I don't know. Must be getting close to the Terry <laughs> Terry Terminal, Ferry Terminal, as well. I want to say, or Terry Terminal, yeah, Terry Terminal. Oh my! Very cool. Oh, what did that say? Porto de Barcelona. Is this the port? It must be. <laughs> Otherwise, it wouldn't have said it, would it? <laughs> it look like a port. That can't be a port. No, near the port. Right, so it's like we're turning off here. Hang on, keep left, and we're not turning. Right. Okay. I don't know, something about, like, now that we're in Spain, I don't really want to go back to France. Spain feels like a level up from France. Maybe it's just because I'm not used to being in Spain, it just feels a bit novelty, maybe.
So I've got to go this way. Is that thing moving? Are you moving, mate? Are you parked? <laughs> ah. I think this is one way. I don't think I can crash here. It's really one. Head on. Oh, yeah, it was one way. So far, so good. Palm trees and everything, eh? Impressive port area, I like it. Nice and easy to get onto the ferry, no messing around. Let's make sure we choose the right destination. Um, it's not Menorca, it's not Marseille. It's not Napoli. Let me scroll down. It is Porto Torres. Um, that is the one that I researched today. Porto Torres. Here we go. You can take a ferry to Marseille from here. Oh, why would you want to do that? Let's drive. Right, let's check out Sardinia. Welcome to Italy. Right, let's not get this wrong. Oh, it's raining, brilliant. Uh, it's a bad start. Hang on. Hang on, stop, 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 stop. Let's get the windscreen wiper off. How, what am I supposed to be doing here? I always get confused with this. Go out of here. Turn left. Right, it's a bit of a way actually to be fair. It's longer than I thought it was, 144 kilometers. <gasps> Ooh, almost crashed there. So, Cagliari, cal, 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 I pronounce it, Cagliari, that's the, I think like the main city on the island, which we're not heading to. Thank you. 
So the problem with all these mods is that there's not necessarily um, what do you call it? Oh, I can't forget the word. Like there's differences between mods, like the quality of them. I'm not saying this is a bad quality one. I've never been to Sicily, I don't know. Um, but there's going to be differences, aren't there, from, you know, when you go over to a new country or a new area. So, yeah, I don't, know, I don't know how good the quality of this map is. I don't know what its reputation is like. I mean, it seems all right. Surprised actually by the roads here. I don't know. I just thought this is an island. I thought it was going to be more kind of more. What's the word? Like you wouldn't know you were on an island here. You know, this feels like we could be on the, on the mainland or somewhere. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? It's. I thought it was going to be more. I don't know. Smaller, I guess. Cuter. <laughs> the roundabout, take the second exit. exit. Oh, we've got one of those video point things coming up. I will be using that. Have a look there. Thank you very much. Although, mind you, it could be on the other side of the road. There's a photo point as well. Um, let's have a look, see what we can do here. Might have to settle for the photo point. Right, where is it? Where is it? Road, isn't it? Just a bit. Of... Go straight on. No, I'm not going to turn off. Oh, it's like a church or something. Where is it? Is it in there? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to illegally stop here and get my camera out. I'll take a picture of this bad boy, the Church of St. Mary of Bethlehem. Nice. I like it. Sorry, just having a photo moment. The video thing is over there. I'll, I'll do that on my way back. Oh, this is nice. Oh, who's got right of Oh, it's a trap! Jeez Louise, I wasn't expecting that. I must have crashed into a tram. Mm, this is nice. Italia. Go straight on. Grazie. Bambino. Ciao. Buongiorno. Sì, si, signore.
I didn't understand that one though. Do you remember when I was in? Um, it was Frankfurt Air Frankfurt Airport. It was one of those photo moments, and he didn't recognise it. I was pointing it at the airport, or the place it was supposed to be. It just didn't work. So this is more like it when I was talking about driving on an island, expecting roads to be like this. Yeah, this is better. Village. I like that, I rate that. Buongiorno. Buongiorno. No cappuccino, prego, prego, prego. Well, this is nice. Fair play. Fair play indeed. You know what, it's been a really nice ride this from beginning to end. Definitely the best journey so far in terms of scenery and enjoyment. We've had, you know, yeah, box standard motorway driving. We've had some nice, we had that mountainous road between France and Italy. Um, interesting driving to the ferry port. Barcelona, Sicily is nice and um, scenic. Where's that way to go? Anyway, we're almost there. I'm surprised by how far we've driven in Sicily. Like I said, I didn't. I thought it would just be really short. Like maybe I don't know, 50 in-game kilometers, maybe something like that. The island's obviously bigger than I thought it was.
sleeping point there that I might need to go to to utilize. And this is a closer one. What trains here? Actually thinking about it, that tram we saw, that was weird because that that was only a tiny little town. Do they honestly have trams in that tiny little town in Sicily? I'm gonna check that out in this video. It's like in Cal in Cagliari, Cagliari, whatever it's called, Cagliari. I can imagine maybe yeah, being trams, but possibly. But why in uh, some tiny little town on the island? Go straight on. Quite far. Hmm. Why is there a ferris wheel there? <laughs> That's an enjoyable journey, that. It's more like it. Uh, what does it want to do? Straightforward. I think it's just reversing into there with loads and loads of space. Um, oh no, it's not. It's not. It's not. I misunderstood it. Okay, that is a bit tricky. Uh, oh, Christ, what am I doing? I'm miles away from it. I think I'll start off by using that camera. I'll turn a bit more. I don't usually use this camera. I think I should. It helps me a little bit. Oh, wrong way. Oh, watch it, watch it, watch it. Okay, stop there. See how we're doing. That helped. Gave me an idea of what I'm supposed to be doing. Um, yeah, don't crash into that. Just a minute. No crap. Okay. Let's have a look again. Okay. Straighten up a little bit. Pull away from that trailer a little bit. Am I missing it? I think it's just the, the shadow, isn't it? The reflect, yeah. That's okay. Um, just keep going back. Oh, okay. I'm missing it. It's quite tricky, this one. Ooh, it's tricky. Jesus, this is the most difficult one I've done. That's tough. A bit tricky, isn't it? I'll get there though. I think I might use this view again. No, because then I can't really see what's on the other side. Just 
make sure you get enough turn on it there oh it's tough though my god it's really tough oh don't hit that crash oh I've touched it okay this is tricky hmm No, it's not right. Change the angle a little bit, I think. This is really tough. Right, get enough on it to start with there, and then start to pull round. Not too early. Okay, maybe, 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 maybe. No, hang on. It's tough. Hmm. I will do it. I'm not going to give up. Right, now I get a full turn on it. That's better. It's much better. Yeah, yeah. That was the one. Don't hit the blue thing, don't hit the blue trailer. Ooh. <laughs> We're getting there, but it's tough. Let's try again. This is the one. Yeah, definitely the toughest one I've done so far. But we got there. We get to the next level? No. Okay, I enjoyed that. Let's have a look where we are at the moment. It's quite a big island. Um, right, we need to now find somewhere to sleep. Um, so I guess we will go. Yeah, probably back to where we came from, and I might even do some repair work as well. Stop there. Okay. Let's go. Let's Sesame. A lot of rubbish there. Go straight on. Who's right of way here? I think they do. Right. Let's do some work first in the garage, sort my truck out. Service, 11% damage, not too bad. Right, there we go. And let's park up.
Okay, that is the end of the episode. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.